What's an unspoken rule of Reddit? Username should not be your name. Apparently putting edit on the post when you edit it. Don't tell real life friends your real Reddit account name ever. If someone recommended Reddit to you IRL, don't ask for their username. We don't do that here. Up at the comment that answers your question. There are no unspoken rules of Reddit. If you do something wrong, someone will tell you. Your post should always be free of grammar and spelling stakes. Ask the same questions that have been answered 100 times already this week. Never tell people it is your cake day. Everyone is wrong and you are right. If you mess up your post title, we will roast the ever-living fuck out of you. If you are going to reply to your own post to make yourself look better, make sure you switch accounts first. Comment before reading the article. Don't try to identify bombing suspects. You mention your dog, you pay the dog tax. Non-negotiable. If you think you know someone on Reddit, no you don't. If it exists, there's probably a subreddit dedicated to it. Sorry, I can't speak about it. Don't post an old safe without unlocking it first. Don't do anything that will expose your real life identity. Always jump to conclusions. Sort by controversial if you want to have fun. If you come upon a thread that no one has commented in over five years, leave it be. Don't join comment chains if you value your karma. Also choose that guy's wife. Be melodramatic about everything. Do not, under any circumstances, bash Keanu Reeves. Don't fuck with cats. Don't respond before looking at ARP's entire post and comment history. When your shoes come off, you are dead. If your mild innocent post gets downvoted to shit, don't think anything of it. Sometimes Reddit users are really weird. The meat of the conversation takes place when the post is still newish. By the time it hits the front page you've mostly missed your chance to really participate. Not very many people read comments deep in the thread s or ones that aren't propped up by upvotes. If you don't share the same opinion of a sub, stay off the sub. Yes it's very stupid but that's how this place operates. It's an echo chamber. Always add to song lyrics, especially when they originally weren't meant to. Create a throwaway account when approaching any contentious topic. Don't ask questions that can easily be googled. You will be downvoted to oblivion in some cases I know from experience. Harass anyone with legitimate questions. I don't think a lot of people follow this, but if you engage with a post or comment positively i.e., the post comment is not offensive, pointless, or needlessly hateful you should also upvote it. I hate it when posts have 30 comments but like 8 upvotes. If it's engaging, upvote it. No use of emojis other than the legend. If you lie about something, someone will crawl out of the cracks and call you out on it with a link to damning evidence. Every single time. That's enough Reddit today requires an obligatory upvote in most cases. If you think you're going to offend somebody, consider writing your post in slightly more general terms. If it's a problem between a man and a woman divorce leave break up with him. Every. Single. Time. No matter what you can think up, there's a subreddit for that. You will get banned at some point and there will be no reason. Assume all Redditors are male. Do not expose the Reddit to light, especially sunlight, which will kill it do not let it come in contact with water and above all, never feed it after midnight. Awards are pointless and nobody should give them out. Poop knives and sons with broken arms are to be referenced as much as humanly possible. 
If I can't defeat your argument, I will simply attack your spelling and grammar. You will laugh at the same 200 posts every year when they get reposted until the end of time. Contrary to what the actual Redicate says, the down vote button is 100 and I disagree button. There are no unspoken rules, the mods will ban you and reference a rule for it that you never heard of but they wrote down offline. Agree with the herd or get attacked. If you don't want to be harassed, just don't say anything. Learn your Reddit history so jokes don't go over your head, like any mention of two broken arms. This ain't Facebook. Keep Facebook shit for Facebook. Impeccable spelling and grammar to the point where you have to let everyone know you edited out a typo or that English is not your first language, no emojis ever. Poop knife. Ask a question that was asked yesterday and everyone will still think it's original. No emojis winking face. Don't cross the streams. Don't tell people you're religious. If I say it then it'd be a spoken rule. No emojis face with tears of joy smiling face with open mouth and cold sweat. If you call someone out for writing something stupid and they delete their comment, you won. Post the wrong answer if you need the correct one fast. 69 and 420 are the funniest numbers ever. Assume the person you're talking to is a child. Regardless, they are going to argue like one. Do not fuck a coconut. If someone complains about getting downvoted, you have to downvote them regardless of what side of the argument you're on. Don't take stock advice from Reddit. Ever. Lie, fabricate, and use hyperbole often. When someone says something that you agree with, you must reply with either came here to say this. Or this. You don't talk about Fight Club. Nobody you know IRL can know your account name. That there will always be a keyboard warrior ready to prove you wrong and make you look ST00PID. Always use a banana for scale. Mention a cat, a photo that cat is required. Put your full comment in one comment. Never reply to yourself. Fourth comment gets downvoted. When you first get the app, look at porn. If you bitch about downvotes you get a downvote. The narwhal bacons at midnight. Be kind and give advice, be straightforward, and love. Compassion goes a long way. This was the hopeful and optimistic part of my let it be so. Be well and kind. If it's an LGBT related post in any way 60 of the comments will spew hate but claim not to be homophobic. Do not take down votes personally. There's seriously no point. And for God's sake don't start whining if you get down voted. That's just a sure way to get more down votes. S is necessary. Nice opinion. Would be a shame if it cost you all your karma. Farming down votes is a thing. No emojis. No emojis. No matter how well you know a subject or how well you present it, there is going to be some moron on Reddit that thinks they know better and that person is going to use multiple accounts to make it look like everyone supports their idiotic point of view. Welp, there goes all the unspoken rules. I can't tell you, because it's unspoken. You always thank the kind stranger who gave you gold. If your post doesn't get 50 upvotes within 5 minutes it's dead. Give me gold gets you gold. Don't have independent thoughts on politics.